All right, welcome back. It's Back to the Basics. I'm Sean Barr, and today we're talking about network architecture, everything from designing a core to distributing those switches and accessing that network. Let's go! Welcome back. We're talking network architecture basics. We are going to be covering the three layers of a traditional local area network, starting with the access layer. So the access layer is where everything connects. Your laptops, your printers, your wireless access points, all of that connects to the access layer. Then from there, going up the stack, the access layer traditionally connects to a distribution layer, which could also be known as an aggregation layer. It's where you have all of these access layer switches, um, and then they connect into the distribution layer. The distribution layer consolidates all of that layer two traffic and sends it up to the core. So really it's, it's about port consolidation and providing connectivity up to the core. And then the core makes all of your layer three routing decisions. So do I send this traffic up to the internet? Do I send it out my WAN? Or do I send it down to the access layer? That's what the core does. In a LAN or campus environment, we talked a little bit about the layers from a switching perspective. Now we're gonna talk about the facilities aspect. So physically, where do these things sit in a building or an office? Well, you've got an MDF, which is a main distribution frame, and you've got an IDF, which is a intermediate distribution frame. Traditionally speaking, core and distribution sit in the MDF. And so those two are close together. They, the core and the distribution connect in. And then there's cabling out to each of these IDFs. And all of your access switches are sitting in those IDFs. And they connect up to the distribution layer in the MDF. So two facility areas, an MDF and an IDF, those two areas in a smaller office could be consolidated. You could just call it an MDF and you could have all three of them, core, distribution, and access, all in one place. Uh, in your environment. So we covered network architecture basics, core, distribution access. We talked about MDFs and IDFs. This is just a basic overview of the components. They can be configured in a multitude of ways. If you want to know more information, maybe about core design or distribution layer design, make sure you leave a comment, like, subscribe, and we will see you on the next Back to the Basics. Thanks for watching.